What do you gotta say about that parking gap? <laughs> yeah, dude. Chick fil A. Yeah, they have these on views out here. Cold yeah, stuff, bro. Yo, Nick, what'd you get? <laughs> Cam with the salad, man. It looks good as hell. And we got the views. Not really. Give me a fork. <laughs> fork. Fork me up. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Yo, what are you guys looking at, dudes? Huh? Trying to find Nemo. Bro, you gotta look for him in the sea, bro. <laughs> How about you, Nick? Did you find anything in the sea yet? No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm back with another part of my youtube channel um obviously you guys notice the scenery kind of change i will show you you guys that here in a little bit i was gonna say next video but uh jumping in uh the q a guys uh so i've been getting so many questions like you may not think i've i've been getting a lot of questions but i've been getting so many questions and most of them just been so repetitive that i've decided you know my my other post on my ig that i said i was gonna do the q a so I can just answer the questions on my YouTube for you guys uh, and that way you guys don't have to keep repeatedly asking me what I do, what I take, whatever, you know. But jumping into it. Alright, so I wrote down the questions that I heard the most repetitively and the ones I felt that I could give you the most on. And before we jump in the video, this is a recent question because everything changed and everything's kind of screwed up right now. I was supposed to leave for basic training September 8th. When you go to MAPS uh, for your the, the, the medical information, like your first time for the military, you're going to the MAPS, you're going to MAPS. Uh, so you go through a whole process and then at the end you choose your job and a selection date that you want to leave. That's, that's on you. So when... Um, for example, we had a DEP call the other day, and I leave. W you get orders for your job, so you get it, for the job you select. While well, I'm stuttering, for the job you select, you leave on orders. Meaning, now I'm not leaving until November 21st, which is well after Halloween and just short of Thanksgiving. Uh, I'm going in for aircraft armament November 21st to San Antonio, Texas, for basic training. Now, like I said, I was supposed to leave September 8th. People are asking me why are, why are you, you're supposed to leave in September, why are you leaving in November now? Well, the answer is I'm leaving on aircraft armament uh, job orders. So I got the job I wanted, which is good. The sad thing is I get to leave November 21st, but I get to duck hunt, I get to deer hunt, get to do all that stuff. And there's a wedding September 16th, which you guys will see dope IG pics from downtown Cleveland. So I'm pretty hyped. So guys, jump into the Q&A, like I said. Um, I'll just read it off the notebook. Um, what supplements do you use? So this is a really normal question I get quite a bit, um, one of them at least. Uh, so my main three is obviously protein. Sometimes I use carbolin, you know, just change that up with um, what, creatine and BCAAs. I don't normally take BCAAs. But uh, to add into that as well is a multivitamin, fish oil, and L-carnitine. If I'm saying that right, L-carnitine, L-cartin. But those are the main supplements. Um, mainly, I just mainly take uh, daily health supplements that are going to improve, you know, longevity a little bit and better body function instead of taking something that's going to improve my body function. That and then just like completely. At some point stops working so and if you want to add in a pre-workout AG here I'll just grab it for you guys uh, unleashed and G fuel which here's my unleashed and then grab my G fuel which is right here in my bag um, this is on the daily typically this usually sits right here in front of my monitor my TV unleashed I usually whoa I usually which is the which is a pre-workout I usually do take at least once a day if I'm like feeling tired and I don't feel like motivated. So like yesterday, I was like, I had this idea and I'm, I'm continuing this way too long here. I had this idea since last Thursday for my desk to move, rearrange and make everything a lot easier in my room. 
and I was just tired and I didn't want to do it. So I took a scoop of pre-workout and I was like, we're getting this done and it got done. And honestly, yeah, I can say it was because of the pre-workout. So it's pretty good. It's not too strong. It's just enough. And G Fuel is uh, energy drink, but it's not an energy drink to where you can't drink multiple of a day. Like there's quite a focus. It isn't gonna focus. Uh, but you guys can look that up. It's pretty healthy for you. So next one, protein sources. So I take protein powder, um, universal animal. If you guys are familiar with that brand, uh, that's pretty good. I got the hookup from Fitness First. Um, that's a good brand, but protein powders I really don't like to rely on besides like smoothies at the end of the day, uh, especially if I'm just like hungry. So I'll add in a bunch of greens, uh, some fiber sources, but protein, you know, usually comes from my chicken, tuna. Um, it could be any kind of fish. I'm fine with fish, just not, I haven't tried um, sushi yet so but definitely like you know I have the source of deer meat so I eat deer meat you know uh, red meats white meats anything you can really think of and eggs eggs are very important uh, especially if you have like a hard time or like you don't really feel like cooking meat or meal prepping or maybe yeah uh, just cook some eggs in the morning for breakfast or cook multiple eggs for throughout the day for throughout the day it's a lot easier and they're very delicious Especially with toast, that's your carb sources right there. Um, how do you get a good pump? Um, well, see, you have to go to the gym. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> uh, it just depends on you. Like, do you go to the gym in the morning or in the afternoon? Do you eat a lot? Do you not eat a lot? So, like I said in the last video, how to get a good pump in the gym, my body reacts to certain things differently. Like, honestly, I can get a pump off a of pre-workout and possibly just a little bit of food and plenty of water. So honestly, you just have to kind of figure it out for yourself, you know, kind of find a happy medium, a good balance. This needs to stop moving forward because the lighting sucks. Um, there's another one, how do you get big? Uh, so one, eat a lot. Two, lift weights or just have some kind of a routine in the gym. You don't have to necessarily lift weights. You could do a bunch of athlete, um, mobility training like Odell does not Odell um, but his younger brother I think it's Terrell Beckham uh, he's a pretty good dude to watch and follow up on so if you guys are interested look him up um, other than that sleep sleep's very important too but uh, yeah eat a lot of protein carbs some you know you have to have some fats but sleep and food and lifting weights um, what camera do I have? So currently I have the Sony 5, A5100, which is a boss ass camera. Very good video quality. Uh, picture quality can be a little bit better. It's not comparable to Brandon Zawicki's, which he has a pretty badass setup. Uh, but it's still a pretty good camera. It's not too big, it's not too small. The only thing I do wish I would have upgraded for was the detachable mic, but there's a big flash, which is pretty cool. Uh, I did cur I did use my iPhone to record for this YouTube channel back in the day, and I'm glad I was able to um, upgrade to this, and honestly, I would recommend it. So, uh, in the next one, uh, Noah asked this, and I wrote this down just because to be funny. Uh, are you a homosexual? The answer to that is no. Uh, what do you think of North Korea? That was another one. Well, honestly, <laughs> that's Tyler's question. Uh, honestly... If they shoot first, we're gonna fire back. I don't think it should be the other way around. I think it's, we're ready to go. I'm honestly pretty excited to go in the military. So um, yeah, that's coming guys. There's a lot coming um, to the channel. That's, I'm wrapping the Q and A up here, right here guys. That's all I wrote down because that was, besides the last two, I thought they were pretty funny and they were on the IG, but that was a lot of the questions that I got you know repetitively so i mean there wasn't many that weren't too like creative besides the last two but i mean like since they're all repetitive i was just like there's no really um specific way to answer it besides like if you ask how to get big or how do you get how do you get big training this or training with that you know i, I could answer those uh i mean personally i'm not the biggest dude i'm not the most fit dude i'm not the fastest dude like 
I can answer on my own, um, you know, what I've been able to do, what I've done in progress, uh, improvements. Uh, I've definitely come a long way in a year and a half, but there's definitely other guys out there that could answer a little bit better than me. But anyways, that I'm wrapping up the Q&A, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, like I said, there's a lot of content coming out. I'm just really slacking. I'm one of those kind of people that sees it in his head, but then doesn't really do it, which is not a good thing. So uh, just expect a lot, of more, a lot more content coming out in the month of September. Like I said, the, there's a... Um, a wedding coming up so uh that'd be pretty cool cool pics so yeah if you guys don't know i have an ig follow the ig in my twitter it's down in the description and i'll catch you guys with a follow back so that's about it guys if you guys enjoyed the video i'll catch you guys next